Okay, the lights are up, they're not on yet. Jay, lucky. are you bored of me yet? No, never. Uh. <laughs> Hello guys and welcome back to our channel. Hello. We are currently on our Jarris adventure week. Oh, you're really picking up the adventure week, can you babe? I'm having Absolutely so much fun. It. We're on day two of Adventure Week where we're kind of staying in like unique stays, I keep calling them, because on Airbnb there's a section. I'm going to explain it's it like, again, it's okay? Like a, a last time on Jarrett. Last time. Yeah, I basically explained this and James took the mick out of me. I'm going to do it again. Um, there's a section on Airbnb which says unique stays and we're staying in somewhere different today. Mm. Last vlog was somewhere else. You're going to have to wait and we see. You will have seen in the blooming thumbnail. We are literally 20 minutes from finishing the last vlog. We're just yeah. in a cafe. We are on our way to the next place. We're going to go like to a little town called Truro, which is quite near way. to where we're staying. So we're going to go and have a look around there after we have some This eggs. looks insane. This cafe is just so lovely. And Mila is here somewhere. There she is, being a good girl as always. Good girl, Mila. Good girl. Sit then. It's a good girl. Good girl, Mila. Okay, so as James said earlier, we are going to a town called Truro. I think that's how you pronounce it. Yeah. Um, which we've just found out is the southernmost city in the UK. Thank you to one of Carlos' friends for messaging us that. Are you excited to be going to the southernmost city in the UK? Get me out of this car. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Make me safe, guys. <laughs> you gonna put your harness on? Like a good, good girl? So we can go and explore? Yes, we are. Come on. Just touched down in Truro. No? Yes. Just yes. Me? Yeah, we're the worst okay. exploring cities. I know, totally. We'll doing. probably be here for like two minutes, then we'll be like, this is cool. Bye. Can you get a coffee. Oh, we'll come. Yeah, go to Costa, go to Topshop, <laughs> and then come back. They have a Topshop. They do. Karis is very excited by the fact they have to. I Actually, Truro, I've the one been going. Yeah, you do. Oh, wait, so it must be a big town. They have a Topshop. <laughs> So exciting. This is actually quite a cool uh, kind of square space. This reminds me of my Spanish holidays. Yeah. Where in the evenings we'd play football when everyone would like have food around the outside. Yeah, it comes with a coffee place. <laughs> That's all that matters though. And a Primark. Woo! The town is actually so cute around here. There's loads of nice coffee shops. There's loads of little cute shops. I've already been in the White Company. Isn't a local cute shop. Isn't a local cute shop. There was 10% off the 60% off, okay? I just had to have a little look. Mila's being very, very good on her lead. Good girl, meals. Okay, so there's this place here called Hub Box. So I think we're, oh, no, oh, we're going into this one. Oh, got it wrong. <laughs> this one is also Hub Box. Is this in the cathedral? This is like a restaurant in a little church or something. So I think we're gonna try this out. Okay, so we've come to a little pub. It's very cute. It's really nice. I won't say it's a pub. I think oh no, it's not. Sorry, it's I'm just calling everything a pub today. I, know. I like it. I know. So we just got some halloumi sticks. Wow. And a chicken burger. Nice. Just a little nibble, you know, to keep us going. Mila's down here, chilling. Got some water. Ice cubes. Maybe ice cubes have melted. Yeah, she did have ice cubes in there, but they've melted. It is very hot It's boiling. We're sweating. I'm in the sun, you're in the shade. I know, I'm chilling in the <laughs> So this is the kind of gardeny yeah. village area. I think it's much smaller than they made it look on the map. Yes. You know when they're like, you know, here's the massive park. <laughs> we thought it was going to be a huge field, mm -hmm. but it's absolutely gorgeous. Thank so you. stunning. Look at the flower colours. So pretty. We found a little field area, so we're gonna let Mila off for a little bit of a run. I think she'll be fine by here. Yeah, she doesn't I, usually bother with anyone. Got her ball, so oh, she's fun. got the ball. She'll definitely be fine. All she wants is the ball. Look, Dad, did you bring it? Did you bring it, Dad? You've got it. Oh. Have you not got one? No. Oh, hard We don't have one. We don't have a ball. Mila. No, sorry. So sorry. I am just waiting in the shade under a tree whilst James goes and gets some water literally just across the road. And Mila, of course, is guarding me as she waits for James. Dad? Come back. Dad, she's literally looking in exactly the direction he went. Do you want to go and run and see Daddy? Go on then. <gasps> Woo! <laughs> Good girl! So we have just been chilling by the tree, just doing Our some tree. things. I'm gonna rename this tree the Jarvis tree. The Jarvis tree, because we've been here yeah. so long. 10 minutes. Just the longest time. Yeah, it's actually just... a long time for us to sit still. It, it is, is unless we're in a coffee it. shop, which is where we're heading now. Still, only about a quarter of an hour. I True. We're quick, we're, we move on. We get bored easily. Okay. Apart from each other. Yeah. Five don't years. Move on from that. Every day. I'm so lucky. Are you bored of me yet? No, never. Uh, Mila's been chilling with us. She's so good. She's off her lead. She's literally going to run away right now, isn't she? And just prove us wrong. Sit. You want to sit? 
No. Um, she's just been sitting here and guarding us, so I'm very proud of you, Mills. Oh. Well done. Well done, Mila. Let's go find the coffee shop. Okay, so much to James's <laughs> hatred. This I is am... how it says every time she starts a, starts a segue. Okay, okay, so. So, much to James's hatred, I'm going into Wilco to pick up the fairy hatred. lights. I'm actually okay with it. Are you? Yeah, yeah I'm surprised you are. You were yeah. like, okay, whatever. We are kind taking of embarrassing. Very narrow pages. We are. Yeah. So, I'm going to go to Wilco yes. and buy fairy lights for the, Which for is, the place. I'm so excited about. I know you are. Do you know what would help you do that? Yeah. Some money. Money. Yes. Good. Yeah, I'm going to decorate the place and make it all cozy for us. Are you excited? No. I'm excited to see the place. Where okay. We need for the With the fairy lights, we'll though. Should I not come in until the fairy lights? Yeah, and then I'll okay. be like, whoa! Yeah. <laughs> We've come into Cafe Nero and it is so cool in here. Guys, it's sweltering in the UK right now. It is like 26 degrees Celsius. I know, this is so okay. hot for us. This is it. I think in like two days time it's going to be 38 degrees in London. How that ridiculous is never that. happened. That is like before. not British weather. And guys, don't forget, we have no aircon here in the UK. We're not going prepared. To be no aircon going, nothing. Only like cafes have aircon, but houses don't. We don't have any don't, preparation. So let's all feel for the people in London who are going to have to yeah. sweat it out in 38 degrees in their beds. Okay. Keep nah, drinking our ice coffees. Nah, that's not cool. That's not cool. So we've got a nice Americano and a nice latte because it's hot. We're three minutes away and we've been passing so many nice restaurants while well, I say nice like we haven't at all we've been passing McDonald's and Pizza Hut <laughs> <laughs> yeah well they're nice McDonald's. restaurants to me <laughs> just saying pizza, not the local McDonald's <laughs> Subway yeah all my faves all the luxury restaurants and last night we stayed in somewhere which was really like in the middle of nowhere yeah. there was actually like nothing nearby this time we're three minutes away from all the good places oh, yeah. and we're so only ten minutes to go back into that kind of city so, yeah. sorted. Location. In one it did say luxury. Oh my god, I think that's our tent. That one definitely is ours. Yeah, because there is <gasps> like more kind of safari tent. That's literally what we've stayed in before. Yeah, <laughs> that little that log is cabin. The last place we stayed. Not here, Not but here. basically they're the places we've gone before like unique stays okay guys so here's our tent we've just had a big tour so we've opened it up and we'll show you around now honestly this is so we even tell people we were, we were glamping we're glamping in a glamping tent so you go in to our glorious tent Hi. oh yeah that is like memory foam Come on, Boo. Keep up with the tour. I thought this was a mirror originally, and I was like, "Ooh, a mirror!" And then it just wasn't. It was but just. It wouldn't make sense because that looks nothing like what's behind. I know. Well, that's what I did. I checked behind, and I was like, "Nope, that's not right." <laughs> we got a little washing place, and then in here we got the bathroom. Hi, here is a mirror. And then we've got the shower here, toilet there. Boom, that's all we need to live. There is a little bit of a breeze going on, so hopefully, hopefully... we'll go through the tent. With all the insects as well. Yeah, yeah the insects will come on in. Happy but they'll days. hopefully come with some wind and some cooling down, because it is boiling in that so tent. So nice here. I know. I'm really looking to chill in. Okay, so I've just taken the cover off the umbrella. Wow! That's not giving us any yeah, that's not great. Um, you can move it loads and just adjust it. I'll show you how to do it now. Okay, that is so cool. Oh no, careful. Boom. That's about as best we can get it. So we got some shade under there on one seat and some shade for Mila. That's all that matters really. Casting shade. <laughs> we are currently just chilling out a little bit. Mila is hiding in the oh, shade. Goodness. James is playing with the oh barbecue. Have you seen it? No. So what? Oh. So you start a fire in there. Yeah, you, I mean, you spice some coal. And cook on there. Start a fire. Let's do that. That'll be How fun. Because cool then you get like a bob. <gasps> can we get marshmallows? <gasps> Yes! You don't even like marshmallows, no. but I do! I'll just toast the, the you know, s'mores? <laughs> I'll just toast the digestive. You're gonna just toast the chocolate biscuits. <laughs> chocolate biscuits. Okay, oh. perfect. I'm actually really struggling with the heat today. I don't know how hot it's actually meant to be right now, but it feels very hot, doesn't it? It does feel hot, yeah. So I've set up my umbrella. I've moved my chair a little bit so it's even more in the shade. I just moved it across a bit so it's fully in the shade. I'm gonna do some work whilst James figures out the I'm barbecue. Gonna <laughs> He's gonna play with his barbecue. <laughs> so, I have eventually made some cups of tea. Um, they took forever to make because the stove just took forever to boil the kettle. Cheers. Kaz is going to do some editing. I'm going to do some sunbathing, obviously, because My I want to get a tan. Again. And Kaz is trying to stay in the umbrella, but she's really struggling. 
to sort keep it keep swiveling out. away from me <laughs> I'm to stay in the shade. it's saying girl get yourself a tan yeah, you need a real tan because that is patchy my fake tan is so patchy right now it's because of all the sweat it's a rub off yes it? I know it is <laughs> <laughs> yeah did she look like she was enjoying she, it she didn't to be fair she yeah. was trying to get away from most of the hug the <laughs> come on yeah. come on look it's my two girls trying to look cute go on oh. Okay. Yeah, we're having so much fun. <laughs> so we've actually just looked up the weather forecast, uh -oh. um, and it's meant to start thunderstorming in like an hour. Oh, no. So I'm not too sure if tonight is going to be the best night for the Barbie. So we may try that tomorrow night. What do no you think? Worry, we're here for two nights. We are here for two nights. So I think we're going to actually do the Barbie tomorrow night, and tonight we're probably going to try and get a pizza of some sort, maybe a Domino's yes. or a Pizza Hut. You're Karen very happy is about currently that. Currently going a bit mental because she hasn't eaten in less than two minutes. Okay, I ate six digestives. She ate six digestives about two minutes ago and now she's hungry again. Boo, I'm not hungry, I'm just hyper because basically because when I'm not digestives. working, I go a bit mad. Yeah, that is true, that Yay. is true. It's Kara's non-working. So there is a massive dog walking field, literally. Look, look your definitions. What? It's not massive. It's huge. It's just this. I think it's massive. It's big for a campsite, 100%. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. You're right. I'm gonna say I'm right, okay? <laughs> Um, we're gonna just do some ball throwing with Mila because we're gonna give her a little bit of a run around. Not that she needs much because it's been so hot, but she loves catching the ball. The sun's definitely Whee! gone in. Yeah, it has. It's starting to cool down because the rain is the coming. The thunder's coming. Uh oh. So we've been having a little bit of a chill out. It is now about ten to seven. James slept for an hour because he hasn't been. Well yeah, he hasn't let's been feeling. Let's all have a sympathy for James. Boo. Come on, let's all feel sorry for him. He's been feeling ill. I Are you know. Feeling better I am now? feeling much better. We both I'm put our glasses now. on. Really hungry. Makeup off. We're ready to chill. We're gonna go and get some pizza from Pizza Hut or Pizza Express. Um, Pizza Hut, I think. Pizza uh, Hut. Yeah, Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut, and we put everything in the tent. You literally just zip the front up, it's so cool. Put everything away, all the cushions and everything, because obviously the storm is coming. So we're preparing Winter for the storm. Is coming. Literally, we're getting scared. We've got the pizzas. We do, and I've just missed the turning. He's driven the wrong, the wrong way. way. I've, never, I've never come this far, so I've done something wrong, guys. This isn't like you. I know. You never I go the wrong way. Good, but you learn the I whole way them. there, and then you learn it you it's repeat quite, it. It's quite a difficult kind of road um, to come off. Like it's not very signposted at all. So sure. I'm I see one. Tururo. That's where Tururo. we are. This Come smells on. so good. Wait, what did you say this side was? So they're chicken bites. Mm, and then um, I'm. I haven't even known what pizzas we're getting. So, so one is just kind of like a meat based tomato. Nice. And one is. Is this the turn? No. And one is a barbecue. Okay, so we're just settling down with our pizza. <laughs> she can't help on... herself. Yeah, she really keeps yeah. tangling herself because we put on this like massive extendable lead <laughs> for while we're eating. Yeah. Um, honestly, we really are the worst campers ever. There's two families over mm. there which have lovelyly mm. barbecued their food. Both the and they're out having nice meals no. and we're just sat here with our pizza with really those annoying people that just get a How pizza. Have got salad we? cream? What's, uh, I don't what's that for know. pizza? I just thought... You just brought all the condiments to <laughs> very exciting. You know, we've got it all. <laughs> Ketchup and salad cream. That's all you Need. I'm so hungry. To be fair, I, know, I wasn't I can't Barbie, wait. but one, I felt ill and tired. Um, so, and two, it was going to rain, and it's not going to rain now. It's not raining so now. So we're back outside. The storm was a false alarm, mm -hmm. by the way. Brilliant. For now. Just after saying that it wasn't going to rain, mm -hmm. it has now started rain. raining. Everyone's gone inside. We're just chilling with the slight raindrops yeah. for now. I think we need to go in before it starts getting too heavy, really. So we don't want a wet dog now, do we? I can't be bothered to move. <laughs> but yes, you're right. We need to go inside. Mila is not allowed on the bed. What are you doing? Uh, no more. You're getting closer and closer. She's been creeping up one limb at a time. And then she stops every time. Uh, 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 oh my! What have you done? You won't see her. I know, literally. She jumps on the bed, walks around, falls <gasps> and then falls asleep. Mila! Sorry about that. Karis actually popped into Wilco earlier and bought some fairy lights. I bought three packs. So I'm actually excited to see how she is going to transform oh, yeah. our glamping pod with your fairy lights. Are you ready? I am. I'll leave you to it and we'll have a surprise at the end. Okay, the lights are up. They're not on yet. Karis is very excited to show me. Have you seen them on? Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Dogs. Cute. Yeah. Nice. Let me try and get a whole picture. Look how cozy 
Oh, that is so good. They look green on the camera, but they're just white, They basically guys. are green. Are they? <laughs> no, they're gorgeous. They look really the sweet. Ones. Have a look at them on the camera. Come and see what you think. Oh, that's cute. It is cute. That it's does look cute. cute. Aww. Mila's going to sleep at the bottom of our bed. So, Amelia just wants to go out and play ball all the time. That's all she wants to do. Come on, guys, let me out. So, you know, we're probably just going to have to go and set aside and do that, let's be honest. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so it is definitely raining a little bit too much to be outside now. So, we're just chilling in the tent. Oh, so Mila's crazy. got her ball still. I know. She still wants me to throw the ball out the door, I think. I know. We're not going to throw the ball out the door for you. We're not going to do... Oh, look at her. I love it when she oh, does that. She's so loving, it's the bed isn't for dogs, but technically you're a friend, not a dog. So <laughs> what is a dog? I guess that doesn't count. Question. Oh uh, look yeah. at us, Thank happy you. families. Very cozy in here. <gasps> I highly recommend tent life. Good enough. Good enough. Okay guys, so we're sat in bed reading. Mila's just chilling down here. I just thought I had to tell you about my book. I've already been telling James oh all gosh, about same. it. So I'm reading The Secret Barrister and it's about the law and about really exciting oh. things like that. It's so interesting, the camera's gone blurry. <laughs> yeah, the camera even unfocused on you. <laughs> the camera's fainted, I think. <laughs> Okay, we're back. So, I have my book. James, don't take the mic. Okay, I have my book that I'm reading. The Unmumsy Mum. I'm just going to block James out. The Unmumsy Mum. <laughs> okay, just to clarify, we are not trying for a baby. I know it really seems like we're really broody, and we are. Don't shake your freaking head. You're so broody. Thank you. Yeah, nod, I'm nod. We're not trying for a baby. But we are very broody, but we are not trying for a baby currently. No. Anyway, I started, I ordered this book because I just wanted to read into it. Can I I'm just, just yeah, go on. I think the reason we're not trying for a baby is because I just went to have a shower in the shower block over there. Yeah. And I came out to Mila sitting outside right. the shower block. Right. When I was meant to be like. Paris and I came back and I went, Karis, why was Mila out of the tent? And she went, was she? I thought she was in her bed. I thought she was sleeping next to me. <laughs> so clearly Karis is not ready for a child. Guys, that's why I've got to read the books, okay? <laughs> I'm getting prepared. I'm taking precautions. So I have my own Mumsy Mumsy book. Um, and I was like, I don't really know how relevant this is going to be to me. I was like, I don't really know who it's for. Anyway, I started reading it. And honestly, the beginning is so... Like, I feel like it's speaking to me. Like, it's like fate. It's That's like, just two you pages. literally, okay, I've read two pages, <laughs> but get this, right? Get this, guys. I've already told James all about this. I'm so, ready. the guy in the book is called James. Freaky or what? Not that freaky, okay? So, I just read on. It's I was like, very That's common fine. name. Sure. Extremely common. And then they basically um, got married at age 23. I'm 23, James is 22, but I'm 23, so that's kind of like, oh my gosh. So freaky, like. No, no because it is, because it's quite young to get married. So I was like, I'm quite surprised that they're married the same age as us. I was like, he's called James, married What's at 23. Years, okay, yeah. fine. Um, and then it was on this about a how a one. couple of months, no, it's not, a uh, couple of months after the wedding, they wanted to try for a baby, which is kind of, I feel like where we're going to be in a couple of months. We're going to be like, okay, really got baby <laughs> fever now, but we're probably not going to, you know, start You're trying really for a baby. People's so don't, boo, I know. I'm just, just saying how my books, you know, okay, may cool. be relevant to my life. To so I was like, oh, okay. No, because again, 23 is quite young for a baby yeah. so the fact that they were considering one i was like that's really similar to us and everyone thinks that we're quite young to try for one so i was like oh that's cool the book's really <laughs> relevant to me next thing you know 23 where are they going on holiday cause in greece where we've just been for the honeymoon which is not no. a common holiday destination Boo. At all. but where did they fly from Cardiff Airport, the same airport we flew from. So I'm three pages into the book and I basically think it's fate and we're meant to be having a baby. Whew, so that was my I just book think update. There's no other way to read into that book. Honestly, I I'm, I, I'm scared I to read on. It's basically going to say on page five, Karis and James have a baby now. Yeah, that's probably is what it'll say. Hope you enjoy my book update. Uh, we don't need an update on James. Venue. No, no, Bill, maybe not, but it's still very similar. So yeah, if you do want to know more about my book about the law, <laughs> then, you know, just hit me up on my vlog channel where I talk about my books. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like our books couldn't sum us up any more, <laughs> like, properly. Me reading the um mumsy mum when I'm not even a mum, and, and you reading, reading a book about law. Barrister. That is just, yeah, that sums though. us right up.
Okay, yeah, good. <laughs> okay, are, so we are now going to shoot off to bed. We just need to head over to our little shack to brush our teeth. Oh, yeah. And then me and Leg can be off to bed and we are going to go sleep. I'm going to sleep so well. It is now, oh gosh, how? Why do I do this? I could have gone to bed what at 8 p.m. It's not 10 past 11. Ooh. I could have gone to bed three hours ago I and I'm know. like, oh, it's a bit early to go to bed. And then, like, it just gets too late then. I know. That literally have always happens to us. No, we will have a good sleep. We will. We'll still get a good eight or nine hours. That is a yes. lot of sleep. Oh, I know, I know. Come on, we, we can do like it. We could have slept like nine until seven and then we could have a really early start tomorrow <laughs> and still had a ridiculous <laughs> Well, it wasn't going to happen, was it? No, it wasn't. Yeah, so we're going to go and brush our teeth, go to bed, and we will see you guys in the morning. So excited to sleep. Like, Same. I think these are We, we get it. You're excited to sleep. <laughs> that, is anyone else? So, is, like, I'm so excited. I don't think I will be able to sleep. <laughs> I'll be in red, like, oh my god, this is so exciting. This is perfect conditions oh for sleeping. Oh my god. <laughs> Why am I not sleeping? This is perfect conditions. This is so exciting, though. Sleeping is perfect tonight. Okay, we gotta go sleep. See okay, you in the morning. See you in the Bye. morning. Good morning, guys. Mila is Hello. literally fast asleep. She's not. Her eyes are wide open. Oh, she was literally just snoring a second ago. She was like... <sighs> She loves a good morning cuddle, Mila her. does. It's like, we, we, you know, we go to sleep for seven hours. She's like, where do you guys go? <laughs> the camera is literally steaming up. How is it? We're so hot in the morning. <laughs> uh, we've literally just got up uh, ten minutes ago. We're not this springy when we first get up. We have been lying here, chilling out. I'm not the springy in the first six hours of getting up. I know, James is not a morning person whatsoever. No. We're going to head off to McDonald's pretty quick this morning because actually we have... a thumbnail to upload i know you don't want to you just want to stay here and chill we have a thumbnail to upload on one of our videos and the signal here is not very good so we're just going to go to mcdonald's yeah and try and get some wi -Fi and wi -Fi. That'll work. a dedication to the channel guys yeah, well and unfortunately i may have to get a mug muffin at the same time i know well yeah i'll just be so sad but i know we we're doing it for you guys <laughs> good Good. Oh, this is meant to be a really cool good morning and it's getting stuck. Good morning. <laughs> so we're now going to head off for a day of kind of like adventure. We're not too sure where we're going to go. We're going to go and explore oh, the issues. local areas. Lovely. Yes, we are. Scratch there. But um, we're not taking you guys with us. That's going to be in our next vlog. So make sure you subscribe. Make sure you notice you're on. Hope you enjoyed so that you can way. come and join us in the next vlog. We're actually going to do like a newlyweds Q and A in it. Yeah. So that should be quite fun. Just to kind of mix it up a bit. There's been so many questions. So we just asked people for questions. Yeah. We're going to answer them during that. Carlos has got loads on her notes. So we're just going to kind of do a bit more of a chilled out vlog. Yeah. While doing some Q and A's because we're staying here again tomorrow night and then we're off to somewhere else so stay Ooh. tuned for that make sure your notes are on so that you stay Give up the video to date like with us. if you did enjoy leave us a comment below because we love reading your comments subscribe if you're new and we'll see you in the next video hope you enjoyed guys see love you soon. so much bye Mwah.